All right, so as you can see, I've already added the garlic, the, you know, the freshly ground two cloves of garlic, and the two tablespoons of honey. It's already in the pan. Now, I've already blended my other spices together in here. I'll put that in there. And of course, my bouillon, dissolved bouillon cubes so that it is a one cup of broth. So the one cup of water is for this. Okay. Now, I'm going to mix that up because you don't want it to, oh God, you don't want it to just be kind of sitting there. Okay. Mm, to God says we don't have smell of this and this actually smells pretty good. It smells more like a breakfast than anything. Okay, don't worry about it being looking dark because that's what you want it to be. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is I've taken an entire lemon and all I really did was cut off a couple of thin end pieces. This is going to be your lemon juice, so you, ju you can just throw them right in there. And then, we're going to take the turkey breast. Notice, it's, this is just like um, a hotel turkey breast. Okay, so we're just going to put this in here, basically upside down, breast side down, because you don't want the breast to dry out. Okay. Runaway lemon. And then what you're going to do is you're going to fill it up with water. Tap water is just freaking fine. Okay, tap water's just fine, and what we're going to do is, that's just going to basically sit in this brine for two days. It's going to sit overnight and whatnot. Okay, and that's just getting a little too heavy. It's going to be in the fridge for two days. Okay, yeah, and you want to move this around and whatnot, making sure the lemons stay in the water. What's going to happen is that the turkey meat is going to absorb the brine, and it's going to make for a very flavorful turkey supper. And this is what I'm making for Easter. I don't believe in eating ham on Easter. It grosses me out. So anyways, I hope you enjoy this, and you find it a delight for your Easter supper, or any supper that you want to make this. Now that is cooking with class.